You know the old saying, fool me once, shame on me, fool me twice, well now you're just being a dick. Nerdy Dude Stuff. What's going on everybody, I'm O'Price and welcome to another video about Bitcoin, cryptocurrency, not really so much Crypto Hopper this time, and all that good stuff. We're going to take a quick gander at the market before we kind of just have a little sit down, investigative topic discussion together, alright? Bitcoin is, uh, we had some serious drop offs, but now it looks like we're building up some recovery. A lot of good climbs on a lot of good coins if you picked up on these dips, a lot of greens. Numbers aren't huge, we're still under a 400 billion market cap, sitting at 333 billion, but if we would have picked up some crypto cryptocurrencies like you know uh, iota i just saw a really good one iota down here at this dip on the screen it had a nice rise so we got a lot of good stuff going on with the currencies anyway crypto hopper here's things stuff i'm not really talking about that today free subscription link in the description so anyway i'm going to pull up some emails that i received and i was like you know you made it big in the world when someone's like uh, invite you as a partnership and they're inviting you to put an affiliate link onto your pages and you're gonna earn money and you know I've talked about I've done this with Lendex and yes I had an affiliate link for BitConnect and a Davercoin and a Hashflare and all that other stuff but um the I started looking at this one and this is for a platform called CoinGridge now before you get on, on a tiffy and your panties in a wad and everything I'm gonna talk about that this is very fishy to me and I'm gonna show you why it's fishy to me and we're gonna look at some evidence that um, I'm not going to spoil it. We're just going to go from there. So anyway, I'm not going to read the email at all. I mean, like word for word, but just looking at it, uh, you know, affiliate link, anyone that signs up for it. A lot of the font looks very familiar to me. The bonus payout 10% for level one, bonus 3% uh, for level two. Coin Grinch, all that jazz. Um, and then the big thing they're toying is it's profit sharing. So this was the first thing that looked familiar to me. It's like, hmm, where does this look familiar to me? We're going to the next email. So then in the next email, when you start looking through the email here, it goes, did you miss the Binance ICO? Coin Grinch is the next Binance with profit sharing. So what Coin Grinch is trying to be is going to be an exchange and they're comparing themselves to Binance. So then I look here, Binance ICO was in June 2017. Their BNB token went on sale for 10 cents and today it's worth 13 with the market cap 1.5 billion. And then KuCoin, same exact figures. This also looked familiar to me, and if you recall a certain blending platform that I did talk about, and I'm going to be showing here in a moment, they did the same thing. If you bought the BitConnect ICO, it was worth $353 a couple months later. If you bought the Davor ICO, it was worth $150 a couple months later. So I was like, hmm, this is very interesting. So I was like, all right, all right, I'll do a little more research. So then I clicked on the video here, and I'm just going to play a little couple snippets of it here and there. Um, <clears throat> and this is from Coin Grinch. So, first things first, the voice is very familiar to me. And second thing, this is animation that's also very familiar to me. And uh, at the end of the day, this is all stuff that looks exactly like Lendex. Now, I'm going to show Lendex here for just a hot second. And all these numbers on screen are literally just numbers. If we go into anything, they haven't actually updated the site since March 31st. You know, it's still an active site. It's still saying payouts, and you're still getting loans and all that good stuff, and blah, blah, blah. They haven't updated any of this. Their lending system hasn't been new in, like, months. And then we are going to go to the internal exchange really quick to see the last time an actual exchange on the LDX token was made so that you can see that there's no activity on this site. And the last time someone did anything was on the 10th of May before that was the 27th of April. Back in the day, you would either get a little pop up at the bottom of the screen that said, you know, we're live, we're online, we're here to talk, and then you can go to the support and ticket. Now, all this stuff looks very, very familiar to me. So then I went to the actual Coin Grinch page, right? I did not log into this page, but all of a sudden everything looks exactly identical to Lendex's homepage, which we're going to see if we can get here. Well, since they had their rework, but this is where you can see that nothing's been happening since March 31st. But yeah, since they had their rework, Roadmap, White Paper Technologies, FAQ, Home, White Paper, Roadmap, FAQ. You could scroll through this. I'm not really going to talk about anything here. Um, other than they're just saying that they're going to be an exchange and then also pops up the live chat we're here to talk exactly like Lendex. now at the end of the day with all this information found i decided to do a quick google search on i literally just put the words coin grinch and Lendex into the same google search and this is what i came across i found this individual named joseph andrew natal natale natalie i don't know if i butchered it i'm sorry anyway he currently has two appointments and uh, doesn't have any resigned appointments, and his total appointments are still two. If you look right here, Joseph Andrew Natalie is a Lendex Coin LTD and Coin Grinch Limited mutual companies. Scroll down, he is the director of both of these companies as well. 
So I found that very intriguing. There's a lot of information about him. Um, I'm not going to go into much more, but the problem is the team gave up on Lendex. And everyone, you know, scam. Coin looks like the exact, like, like London currency and all that stuff. Um, nothing is going on in the actual platform itself. I think I signed up so I can't go back in. Nothing, okay, nothing's going on on the platform itself. Their coin's not worth anything. No one's buying, no one's trading, no one's lending. So now they're flipping right around and trying to do another project. Because uh, I'm just going to say it. I fully believe that the team behind Lendex is now trying to do coin grinch and you can see the difference when they try to make their own coin versus you know when they try to do the other one so just some interesting stuff to me um, i'm not going to be promoting or posting the link for uh coin grinch to get into the ico i don't really have any faith in this uh going forward because of what has happened with lendex and it's just unfortunate you know if they maybe didn't leave such a bad taste in my mouth with the fact that they let their lendex platform die and not even do anything then why you know why why start another project when you can't even complete the first project so anyway let me know what you guys think if you've got these e oh that was another thing first off i was like why am i getting these emails as well this is my personal email i know i have it posted occasionally on a couple of sites like you could see it back on the dashboard when i went to lendex but i posted my nerdy dude stuff email in an actual video and that's usually in the descriptions as well so why wouldn't people reach out to me there if they're like oh we want you to be a partner and then i realized this is something that's already has my email in their system and that also kind of made me piece it together as lendex so anyway that's enough of investigative exploring and reporting for me uh, thank you very much for watching this video. If you made it this far and you haven't subscribed, please smash that subscribe button. I highly appreciate it. Leave a like, leave a comment. They're all great ways to support the channel for free. I'm O'Prius, and we'll see you guys next time.